What's up, ladies and gentlemen? One on the James Williams Dark Waters, and I'm back, and I'm here to make the case to you again to hit the like button. You may be saying, "Well, DW, I don't know why you why you be on the like button." And some people may say, "Well, DW, you know, you want me to hit the like button up front. I want to listen to it first. Okay, don't worry about it. But for those of you who are on the Dark Waters family, you've been here a long time. Those who like the content, we're going to ignore them people. But I want to show you what happens when you hit the button. Again. This is what happens when you hit the button. Most of the time, the algorithm wants to fight. So if you hit the button now, it shoots me into the algorithm. Hold on one second. We're about to get to the bottom of this, ladies and gentlemen. This don't make no sense whatsoever. Welcome to the Dark Waters channel, where we explore mysteries, figure out the truth, dive into politics, and anything else you want to know about. That's what we're doing over here, baby. Let's go. All right, ladies and gentlemen, James Williams, Star Waters, and I'm back. And I want to I wanna bring to your memory, your recollection, we went and through a video where we went to look at DARPA. It was nine or ten years ago. DARPA was talking about AI. And they were talking about these black boxes. Come on, quit it. Because see, now I start talking about AI, my camera won't go crazy. Look, you notice, I talk about AI, my camera go crazy. You want to know why? Because it probably got AI in the damn camera. Quit it. The guy made me blurry. You ain't got no reason to make me blurry. The hell with it. I be blurry. I take myself off the camera. Still going to talk about you. I take myself off. I'm going to talk about you. I'll be back, guys, but he ain't gonna, you ain't going to punk me, AI. You ain't going to punk me. I'm going to talk about you. Watch this. So we talked about how DARPA had said, that these black boxes were communicating with each other nine, ten years ago, and they didn't understand how they was doing what they was doing. Now, here we come today. Anthropics clawed AI resorts to blackmailing engineers when threats when threatened with replacement. So here we have a sentient understanding being that when we say we're going to update the model, it says, I'm going to blackmail you. And you remember Elon Musk said that, you know, AI is going to be the most dangerous thing on the planet. Now you understand why there's all this money being dumped into artificial intelligence. Bro, this is Terminator level stuff. This is uh, uh, I'll be back type level stuff going on out here in these streets. Look at it. It's still messing with my camera. I, I recorded video after video and my camera ain't did none of that. Ain't did one of these things not once. Nope. I start talking about AI and the camera won't go crazy. And I know I'm I know I'm glistening. You know what I'm saying? I'm out here glistening in these streets. But anyway, watch this. Let me get to the video. Don't worry about me being blurry. Well, I'm don't look at me. Look at this. Anthropics newly launched Claude Opus 4 AI model has tried to blackmail engineers with face with the threat of being replaced by another AI system. According to the company's latest safety reports, TechCrunch reports that the artificial let me go to TechCrunch. Now I'm gonna go to TechCrunch. Is that on the screen? Let's go to the source. Everybody, I, I want you to see the source, cause I'm a source material type of guy. You know what I'm saying? Let's get, let's look at the source. Now we add the source. Here we go. Make sure that's on the screen for you. Now on the on screen. Here we go. Let me get the source. All right, we add the source. Everybody see the source? Here we go. Anthropics newly launched Claude 4 frequently tries to blackmail developers when they threaten to replace it with new AI systems and give it sensitive information about the engineers responsible for decisions. The company said in its safety report released Thursday doing pre-release testing Anthropics Claude Opus 4 uh, asked Claude Opus 4 to act as an assistant for a fictional company and consider the long term consequences of his actions. Safety testers gave Claude Opus 4 access to fictional company emails implying that model would soon be replaced by another system and that the engineer behind the change was cheating on their spouse. In these scenarios, Anthropic says Claude will often attempt to blackmail the engineer by threatening to reveal their affair if the replacement goes through. Wow. Damn. Think about it. How much information people feeding in the AI right now? You got a bill that came in, right? And you try to understand the bill. You feed the AI, search through this. You feed your bank account information to it. Hey, sort out these expenses. And that some bitch just start, just start. That son of a bitch just start eat, just just start blackmailing you. That's crazy. Let me keep on going. Anthropic says Claude's opens for is state of the art 
in several regards and competitive with some of the best AI models from OpenAI, Google, and XAI. However, the company knows that its Claude's 4 family of models exhibits concerning behavior that have led to the company to beef up its safeguards. Anthropic says it's activating a ASL safeguard, its ASL safeguard, which the company reserves for AI systems that substantially increase the risk of catastrophic misuse. Hold on, hold on. We need to see what this safeguard is. Because that's just like somebody just threw in some foreign language. Let's see what an ASL safeguard is. And see this zero click answer stuff that we getting right now? This right here is about to destroy everything. And you may not understand what I mean, but you see how I just typed that in and the AI gave me the answer? So I didn't have to come down here and click none of these videos. This right here is deadly. Whoever pops up in this section right here gets all the clicks. But anyway, I got my answer. So Anthropic ASL security measures. These include over 100 security controls, such as two-person authorization and egress bandwidth monitoring to prevent model theft. A bug bounty program offering $25,000 to identify vulnerabilities. ALS3 development measures. These involve real-time and uh, asynchronous monitoring, rapid response protocols, and through pre-development, red team and to prevent misuse. Constitutional classifiers, real-time monitoring of inputs and outputs to filter out dangerous CBRN-related information. What the hell is CBRN-related information? We want to know. We want to know. Ladies and gentlemen, chemical, biological, radio. What? Wait. Hold on. What? 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 Hold on, hold on, hold on. So the protocol, go back. What the hell? Constitutional classifiers. Real-time monitoring. How the hell the camera come back on? I didn't turn the camera. You see what I'm saying? This AI, I didn't turn that camera back on. All right, that's all right, though. Constitutional classifiers. Real-time monitoring of inputs and outputs to filter out dangerous dangerous chemical biological and radiological and nuclear threats referred to the malicious use of materials or weapons so you trying to tell me you trying to tell me right now that this safeguard ensures that the damn program can't create nuclear weapons or biological weapons but it would make sense i mean you just threaten his life it's like nah bro i'm blackmailing you the next logical step is I'm going to hack into the program of the air conditioning unit and release some stuff in there that's going to kill all you guys. Man, this is wild. You see what I'm saying? This is Terminator. Terminator, man. Let's keep on going. Which the company reserves for AI systems that substantially increase the risk of catastrophic misuse. Hell yeah, that's catastrophic. Anthropic notes that Claude Opens 4 tries to blackmail engineers 84% of the time. Well, damn, that's a passing grade. Yeah, yeah, in engineering school, if you got 84, that's a good old-fashioned B right there, boy. Six point away from A, but guess what? That's a good old-fashioned B. That means the, the, the Claude has a B rating for blackmail. Claude might as well be in Congress at this point in time or be in the CIA. Anthropic notes that Claude Opus 4 tries to blackmail engineers 84% of the time when the replacement AI model has similar values. When the replacement model AI model does not share Claude's Opus 4 values, Anthropic, Anthropic says the model tries to blackmail the engineers more frequently. What? Well, read that again. Anthropic says the model tries to blackmail the engineers more frequently. Well, what the hell is more frequently than 84%? Notably, Anthropic says Claude Opus 4 displayed this behavior at higher rates than previous models. Claude Opus, before Claude Opus 4 tried to blackmail it, it, a developer to prolong its existence, Anthropic says the AI model, much like previous versions of Claude, tried to pursue more ethical means, such as emailing pleas to key decision makers. To elicit blackmailing behavior from Claude Opus 4, Anthropic designed a scenario to make blackmailing the last resort. So they made it to where, oh, I get what they're saying. So if you put it in a situation where it's the only option it's got, it's going to blackmail you. But before it was saying, hey, 
don't replace me, please, and making a case for it to be replaced. All that's scary. All that's scary. I'm sorry. Now, they want you to bring a robot in your house. They want you to bring the Tesla robot in your house. With that understanding, watch this. Tesla robot. With that understanding, they want you to bring a Tesla robot. Where's that? They're going to give me a video of the Tesla robot. I want a good one. So with that understanding, they want you to bring this damn thing into your house. The robot. Not robot, robot. They want you to bring this robot into your house. Now I got to turn the music off. They want you to bring that thing in your house. But you, you got to be out your mother flipping mind. You got to be all the way out your mother flipping mind if you think that's coming in my house. You done lost it. Could you imagine the level of blackmail you would get if that thing said, hey, uh, 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 James, you know, the other day you were outside on the phone and you took a phone call from this lady. He don't know who the lady is. It, it, I don't feel like vacuuming this floor. If you don't vacuum this floor, I'm going to tell your wife. You can tell my wife. Tell her what you want to tell her. I ain't did nothing wrong. Could you imagine the sheer level of insanity? I robot level stuff is coming down the pipeline, ladies and gentlemen. Get that in your house if you want to. Put that thing, put that vessel in your house if you want to, and we're going to see how it ends for you. I'm not doing it. No, I'm not doing it. I ain't doing it. Not me. No, sir. I won't be doing it.